right so because previously i've done quite a lot of benchmarks on spider-man remastered i wanted to do this comparison using all the same settings so display and graphics exclusive full screen blah 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 uh vsync on uh boom and then i'm leaving this off because in spider-man remastered i don't have this on and what i found is in spider-man remastered it's nice to use amd fsr 2.0 and yeah fsr 2.1 but i actually find that the fps for me in any way is better if you use rgti on the quality you just get smoother and faster gameplay and then graphic settings it's on the medium preset just to uh, just to be able to compare the performance of this game to Spider-Man Remastered and then also just to be able to incorporate it to my other benchmark results. So let's get to it. Right, so first and foremost, can we just take a moment to appreciate how freaking awesome the black and white costume is. I don't know why, it makes me feel a little bit like Kill Ball or Bruce Lee Enter the Dragon. But anyways guys, I've been looking forward to this game. Happy days this year. So, um, in, the, in my two previous videos, I benchmarked the latest driver, which is specifically for Miles Morales Day Zero, which is uh, 526.98. Um, and then I benchmarked it against 526.86 with and without recording software. And what I found is 526.86 actually performs better in games. Um, than the latest driver so I promised one of my viewers that I'd actually benchmark Miles Morales because I wasn't able to do it at the time as soon as I got the game I was going to benchmark it and then uh, see which one actually performs better and from what I can tell guys uh, first and foremost in this split screen comparison there is recording software so it's not a true reflection of FPS because you do lose FPS and it does mess with your uh, CPU and GPU but in my synthetic benchmark, without uh, OBS, you're going to be very surprised. Beautiful game. Right, so for my, my benchmarks of 526.86 versus 526.98, the latest driver. Um, as I said, I think you will be surprised. Because as you can see, the previous driver actually, that same benchmark I just did now, um, without recording software, I get 75 FPS um, on the previous driver. On the latest driver, without recording software, I actually get 73 FPS. So you can actually see that the previous driver, 526.86, is better for Marvel Spider Man Miles Morales. You get a slightly higher FPS. Not only that, let me just go a little bit further. So uh, in my previous video, I compared. Um, benchmark over 10 games um, the latest driver versus the previous driver and as you can see uh, 526.86 over 10 games gives me an average FPS per game of 74.76 and then 526.98 gives me an average over 10 games of 74.31 so as you can see 526.86 is a slightly faster drive and it's actually quite a decent drive um, and to go one step further than this if you if i if i include miles morales into that benchmark so now over 11 games um, my average fps per game on 526.86 is 74.78 because i included miles morales there and then for 526.98 average FPS per game is 74.19 so guys just pause it over here have a look at my stats you'll see 526.86 is better for Spider-Man Miles Morales in terms of average FPS and it's just generally better in terms of average FPS for most games anyways guys thank you so much for watching um, if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to smash that like button. Um, if you haven't subbed to the channel just yet, please go ahead and sub. 
Um, I will be pushing out a, a, a Miles Morales first impression video. However, I've literally, I've literally just started playing this game and I've already done the video. So I want to enjoy it first. And so what I'll do is play a little bit, get a feel for it. Um, it does look flipping awesome. The graphics are a little bit better than remastered. The performance is a little bit down but the swing seems faster seems better i didn't think i'd like miles morales as much as i did uh, peter parker but it gets growing on me man it's a better looking game it seems the string is a lot better um miles looks like will smith before he slapped uh, chris rock 20 years before he's a good looking kid um it looks like a freaking awesome game anyways guys thanks for watching cheers